This is your Daily Mix. The following segment is sponsored by Welcome everyone to your Daily Mix. Today we are joined by Vlasta Hakes. She is Director of Corporate Affairs for Global Healthcare Company, Griffles. Vlasta, thank you so much for being with us. Thank you for having me. Let's talk a little bit. First of all, what is Griffles? Griffles, as you mentioned, is a global healthcare company. And what we do is we take plasma and we make medicines out of it. These are life-saving medicines that treat people with rare and chronic conditions. And to collect this plasma, Griffles operates a network of plasma donor centers under the names of Biomat USA and Talifers Plasma Resources. Okay, when you think of the word plasma, you think of something that is man-made. It is man-made, but it's made in our bodies. What is plasma for anybody who doesn't know? Plasma is the liquid portion of the blood. It contains proteins and antibodies that help our bodies function. So pain people who are born without these proteins or properly working antibodies have lifelong conditions that impact how they live their daily lives. So they depend on medicines made out of plasma to be able to live a little bit more normally like the rest of us. Okay, and there is a massive need right now for plasma. Please explain. Absolutely. Uh, due to COVID-19 and the fact that people were social distancing and hesitant to go out, uh, there has been an impact to plasma collections. And patients need these medicines, whether there's a pandemic or not. So we're asking people as they get more comfortable going out, as people are getting vaccinated, to come back and donate plasma or consider donating plasma for the first time as a way to help and support their community. Okay, so I've never donated plasma, donated blood, but never plasma. How does it work and is it painful? So first of all, it's a painless procedure that thousands of people do every single day. And plasma donation is very similar to blood. The biggest difference is that it takes a little bit longer because we keep the plasma, but we return the red blood cells. And this way your body quickly regenerates plasma. So you can actually give much more frequently than a whole blood donor. You could give up to twice a week with a full day in between. So, you know, a lot of people do obviously with COVID are concerned about this, that or the other going out. And as you say, people are getting comfortable or more comfortable, but you two are also uh, doing things to make sure that you are safe when people are coming in to donate. Absolutely. The health of our donors and employees has been Griffel's number one priority since the pandemic started and pre-pandemic, actually. And we have to implemented all the protocols that the CDC has required and beyond. We have um, enhanced our cleaning. We uh, require PPE equipment by all of our employees. We've installed plexiglass and uh, implemented physical distancing between donors. We also still require that everybody wears a face covering just as an extra precaution. And we do a full symptoms check of so both employees and donors prior to coming into the center. And I love about this too, is it's not just about um, being able to help out the community, but the community really rallying together for people right here who live in our area. Absolutely. Our centers are consider themselves a pillar of the community. They're small businesses. They depend on the employees coming from the local area, donors coming from the local area. And as a result, each of our centers takes the time to identify an organization that they partner with. We have a program where donors can actually donate a portion of their compensation that they receive for donating to these organizations. So it's a, it's a win-win for, for donors. And let's talk about that. There is a compensation for donating plasma? Yes, there is. And that's because of the time. As I mentioned, it takes a little bit longer. And also, donors can donate more frequently. So as a thank you to show our appreciation for their effort, we provide a small compensation as, as a thank you for their continued commitment to donating. And your locations are right here in our area and expanding. Yes, yeah, so we have two, uh, two centers uh, in the Reno area. We're also opening up a new center this summer in Carson City. All right, so great news. And if people would like to get more information about where you are and where you're expanding, how can they find you? Uh, they can visit us at grifflesplasma.com where we have all of our donor requirements, our COVID precautions, as well as contact information for all of our centers. Blasta Hakes of Griffles, thank you so much for what you do in our community and for our community. We appreciate it. Thank you for having me. This segment was sponsored by The Food Bank of Northern Nevada needs your help. Drop off a donation at any Big O Tires location from May 27th to June 13th and get a free tire rotation, alignment check, and brake inspection. Help out our community in the Food Bank of Northern Nevada with News 4, Fox 11, NSN, and Big O Tires.